Hey everyone, it is Fitz with your daily delivery. I hope you're doing well. I am good. I'd be better if basketball season wasn't over at Kansas State. The women lost on Sunday. It's over. Moving on to other things. And I know what a lot of you are thinking. What do I do with this fandom? I can't keep it pent up until football. I got this purple stuff that needs to come out. I've got your answer. That's why I'm here. Baseball. If you haven't been following along, and a lot of you haven't because we've been distracted with other things. It's time you pay attention to Kansas State Baseball. First reminder, please subscribe to this YouTube channel. We need it. Please hit the thumbs up. If you like the video, leave those comments like Tim. Hi. You can, you can say more than that if you want. I'll have some more little things at the end here. If you're an avid viewer of the DD, please stick around for that. Let's talk baseball. K-State is 5-1 and one in Big 12 play. They're leading the Big 12. It's early. It's really early for K-State because they've already had an off week in, in league play. And a lot of schools, most schools, have nine games under their belt. But, but K-State will be at home this weekend. And you know what? I'll get to that in a second. But let's talk about this team. Tyson Neighbors, their All-American closer, uh, was out earlier in the year. He's back. He's back doing his business. Jackson Wentworth did an amazing job filling in for neighbors when he was gone. Uh, but now they've got their man. If K-State gets a lead, they take the ball into the ninth, he usually shuts them down. It's a thing of beauty. But also, they got three players in the field who are playing at Big 12 levels. It starts with Kalen Culpepper, K-State shortstop. This kid is just really fun to watch. And then in left field, you got Chuck Ingram. He's a Wichita State transfer, and he has just really boosted this lineup quite a bit. And Brady Day, the second baseman, turned down a professional offer uh, to come back and play one more season at K-State, and it's working. This team's really good. 17-6 and six and 5-1. and one. But I mentioned they're home this weekend, and I don't know if you've ever heard of uh, the Texas Longhorns. Uh, yeah, they're leaving. Uh, you don't really need to get to know them. They're, they're leaving next year for another conference. But this might be the last time they come to town in anything. I don't know. I haven't checked all the schedules. But certainly, last time in Manhattan for baseball. I know that's a fact. You want to get out to Toynton. Here's the best part. As I sit here tonight, the weather forecast for uh, Friday and Saturday are highs in the 70s. Sunday right now is a little cooler. Check your local forecast. It could change a lot. It's Kansas in March. But it should be beautiful weather. Let's see if K-State fans can pack out Toynton this weekend and show the same passion for baseball that they just showed for women's basketball. Because I got to tell you, I was in Bramlage Coliseum for both those women's games. It was absolutely amazing. You are incredible fans. Let's see if baseball can keep it going. Uh, certainly, taking a series with Texas, let alone sweeping them, would be a huge statement about where this team and the program's at, and they have an opportunity, opportunity to do it. We'll see you at Toynton. Now also, if you're an avid viewer of this uh, daily delivery, and so many of you are, thank you so much, could you make sure you're subscribing to the channel, because that really helps us. And also hop over to our Big 12 Insiders channel. We're trying to get it established, but we're not nearly high enough in subscriptions and other metrics for YouTube to uh, really push us out there. So we need to get that going, if you could do that. And also go check out Mail Rig Golf Clothing. I've said it over and over. I love this stuff. Unfortunately, this style of shirt, I think, is now uh, sold out. So they've moved on to some other things. But they're constantly rotating. Go check it out. Mail Rig Golf Clothing. The link is in the story. 10% off with the Life of Fits discount. And let's be honest, you can get a lot for not very much money. And I, I just love their stuff.